All right, thanks, Dylan. And we go now to an update. Eight former priests who headed parishes in the big country have been accused of child sex crimes. The San Angelo Diocese releasing a list of 13 clergy members today who have been accused of sexual abuse of a child dating all the way back to the 1950s. This list includes four priests of the Diocese of San Angelo, one permanent deacon, and eight priests from other dioceses or religious orders ministering in the diocese. Now, it's important to note many of these de are deceased or have been removed from the ministry. Phil Prazen is in Austin digging deeper into this story. We took your concerns to the Texas Attorney General. His office spokesman, Mark Rylander, sat down with me to explain why they're not investigating these allegations just yet. But every state is set up different. Every state has different statutes. Some states have the ability to go in to an issue where there's reports like these and blow the whole thing up and prosecute and take down. In Texas, the law is set up differently. Rylander says state law doesn't give the Attorney General primary jurisdiction jurisdiction over these cases. Primary jurisdiction is the ability to investigate a local matter alone. Investigating and prosecuting allegations against priests must begin with local police and district attorneys, he says. They must ask the AG to step in to lead or to help on a local crime. We have to rely on local district attorneys from the 254 counties in our state to either refer the case to us or to ask for our assistance as they investigate and prosecute these cases. And you can get a full list of names at BigCountryHomepage.com.